Hello there everyone, Mediocre Otaku here, and today we're going to be looking at the Clonad Collector's Edition Steelbook. Now this has both uh, Clonad and Clonad After Story on it, so it is a lot of episodes, uh, 49 to be exact. Get this a little bit closer here, so you can make out the details a little bit better. This is only Region A, and has the English and Japanese audio. Now this does have a slipcase like all of Sentai's other steel books. So let's take it off. It's a snug fit, but this is how everything looks without it on. And as you can see, the steel book has a full image right here if you expand it. This would be a cool way to display it, but it would take up way more room than is necessary. So it's probably no one's going to do that. Now, one of the main reasons why I wanted this version was because I, I was curious about how they'd fit six discs in a steelbook. I thought maybe they would get some sort of oversized steelbook or something, which would have been cool. And um, Sentai does do sort of unique stuff like that with some of their collector's editions. But instead, you open it up, and... It's a goddamn stack pack. For the sake of my convenience, I'm just going to take all the discs out at once and uh, show you what the inside of the steelbook looks like, because I'm not, <laughs> I hate dealing with these. And I guess we're just going to go through the discs like this. So here's disc one, disc two, and here is the third and final disc for the original Clonade series. Disc four. Disc 5, and Disc 6. So this is what the inside artwork of the steelbook looks like. Pretty nice, I like it. And that's going to do it for the Clonade steelbook. Um, I'm not happy with uh, the way they chose to package this, but uh, I guess I mean this is really what I was thinking they would have to do, but I was like, no one uses stack packs anymore. This is, you know, Sentai is going to figure something else out, but, uh, I was wrong. Now, now look at what I have to suffer through. Um, you know, it's, I, I am overreacting, obviously, but this is like the most inconvenient way you can possibly package discs. So, um, if this is a deal breaker for you, uh, at least you know now. <laughs> um, but that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.